Here we are again, folks. The finished product. It's game day. Look at these garlic and Parmesan wings. I just can't help myself. It makes me quiver. Welcome back to my channel, everybody. And today we're gonna get started off making these wings with our chicken our minced garlic, Parmesan cheese, we've got our butter, we've got our seasoning, our lemon juice, God, can't forget the cornstarch, but really wanna break these wings down. I've done it before in a previous video, but I'm gonna show you how to do it again. It's game day after all, why not? If you're new to the channel, make sure you've hit that subscription button as well as turn on your post notifications so you won't miss a single upload. When you're dissecting these wings, you want to make sure you have a very sharp knife and you're going to cut off your flappy uh, or your little wing tip at the two joint uh, bone. You'll feel around and feel that little uh, cartilage in there and then you're going to dissect that in half. So you have a drummy and a flat and per usual, you know I'm about that flat life. Uh, drummies will do for whatever reason, but flats are just better. And I'll show you again how to dissect that down. So those two bones at the flap tip, slice. I'm feeling around right there for the other break between the flat and the drummy. A little pressure and pop, look at that. Easy breezy. And the grocery stores will charge you more to buy these wing dings already dissected it's or, uh, or cut in half. It's easier for you to learn the tools and the tricks to do it yourself, to save yourself a little bit of money, especially in these days. All right, and a little pressure, and we have sliced. And because this process can be a little time consuming, we are going to jump in that time lapse. <laughs> Oh goodness, I can't wait to devour these once they're all finished. I love chicken wings. They're the perfect game day snack. Well, they're the perfect anytime snack. Who am I kidding? They're delicious at all times, like all the time. <laughs> all right, now we're gonna clean our station. We see here we've got our wings in a bowl ready to go. Now we're gonna start the seasoning process. Right, gonna get started off with some kosher salt. Let us not forget that fresh cracked black pepper. <laughs> and you're just gonna go light here because you're gonna season these uh, later on in the uh, experience here. So you wanna get them coated. So just enough season to coat them, but you don't wanna go overboard now because you're gonna wanna season them later. Cornstarch is my secret ingredient here for getting perfect crispy wings in an air fryer or even baked in the oven. You could also use a potato starch or a light dusting of flour. Uh, the wings will have renderings in them and as the chicken cooks and the juices start to flow, they will run out, meet the heat and begin to, you know, crackle and create that nice crusty skin that we all love so much. Use the tools that God gave you, folks. <laughs> Get them hands in there and make sure you have enough cornstarch to have a nice dusting all over all your wings. And don't be afraid to add a little more. Never hurt nobody. <laughs> yeah, I wanted a little more. There we go. Nice and evenly coated on all sides and shake off any excess. Oh, the 
never used ancient cookie show <laughs> cookie sheet pardon me we all have a cookie sheet that looks like this it's been burnt in the oven a little too long one too many times <laughs> that's what we have foil for just cover it up it's non-stick and you'll be good to go i need to buy a new pan i know that's just very well seasoned don't judge me <laughs> in your kitchen you can do what you want okay <laughs> All right, we're gonna go ahead and carefully lay out our chicken wings on our wire rack so we can uh, allow for even distribution. All the renderings can like drip down to the bottom and collect there in the pan, leaving us with perfectly smooth, crispy chicken. Like crispy. <laughs> I giggle a lot. It's early in the morning. I haven't had my beverages yet. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> So when you get a chance, tell me down in the comments below, what's your favorite game day eat? Are you a sliders person, wings, nacho, queso, guac, meatballs? Like, what, like what's your jam? I really enjoyed making this playlist, uh, really finding things to do with, you know, getting all the game day stuff out there for all of you. You bake these in an oven, flip them about halfway, and now we start getting saucy, folks. We start getting saucy. Gonna go ahead and reduce down your butter over low heat. You don't wanna burn your butter. Um, kinda let that do its thing until it's completely melted and then we'll move on to our next step. I wanna give it a stir, help it out a little bit. Mmm, butter. Liquid gold! And for once, I'm not talking about cheese. Now we're actually making two different types of wings today. I'm doing a garlic Parmesan wing and a classic lemon pepper. So we're gonna get started with that while our butter is melting down. I'm gonna throw in a little garlic, cause you know, garlic and butter, I can't think of a flavor pairing that goes better with anything. <laughs> Other than, you know, chicken wing and hot sauce, but whatever. Two generous bloops. <laughs> Don't worry, all the exact measurements will be done in the box below. Don't worry. Gonna add in our Parmesan cheese. Chop, chop, chop. Chop, chop, chop. Chop that cheese up. Get our knives together. We're gonna actually chop up a little uh, fresh parsley. A little food grass, you know. It has a nice herbaceousness to this dish and, and a beautiful aromatic as well. We've added our garlic, we've added our Parmesan, we've added our parsley, tidying up the workspace because the only thing that's left to do with this sauce, after you get it well incorporated, is to what? Add the butter. You know, it's still doing its thing and it's all now melted down. Look at that pool of deliciousness. And then we'll just pour it on in there. And give it a nice, generous mixing. Get it nice and well incorporated. And if you found this video beneficial to you in any way, or you just like me, please subscribe. Give the video a like. Leave a comment. Tag me on Instagram. Mmm, that buttery garlic parmesan -y goodness. Just out of this world. 
That's your consistency you're looking for. You can add a little more cheese if you'd like. Now for our next sauce, we've got more butter reducing. Adding in some lemon pepper seasoning. You can also make this seasoning uh, yourself from scratch. I think I should do a video on that. Uh, crushed red pepper flakes, because you know, who doesn't like a little heat? Per usual, you know your spice level. I am not in your kitchen, you know. Don't get crazy. And some cracked black pepper, because there probably wasn't enough in the actual seasoning. I like a bigger, you know, speck of pepper for these wings, which is why I, I put that in there. Lemon juice, lemon, lemon, lemon juice. You've already got enough lemon from the actual seasoning, but a little more never hurt nobody. You know, just a little bit. And then more butter. Oh, ho, 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 ho. look at that. Typically you could have you know, tossed your wings around in the butter lightly once and then added your seasonings and toss them in a dry rub. So you have a drier wing for that. Um, added in a little more garlic uh, powder and just dusted it up again because you really want to get those flavors in there. And we're going to start with dressing our wings. Put them on in, don't be scared. Oh my goodness, if you could smell this kitchen right now, it is just wing heaven. And the fact that it's not deep fried, the house doesn't smell like fried grease uh, or dirty grease, like baked wings, air fried wings, those are the way to go. Once you've got these wings all in their sauce, if you had a bigger bowl, you can just literally toss them in it, but I don't know why I didn't use it. So I used my favorite wooden spatula or wooden spoon, and I'm just gently coating these in that garlic parmesan buttery goodness. Look at it. Look at it. It is taking everything in me not to snatch one of these wings up right now. You know what? We're gonna give it a go. Let's toss this. La 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 la. Ooh, look at that. Slow it down a little bit for you. I'm trying a new effect. And now we are tossing in our lemon pepper. The citrus notes that I'm getting from this is just heavenly. Like I can't even just give me all the sopped up deliciousness. And when you've got a nice coat, it should look just like that. You could take some time to zest some fresh lemon over this when you present it to your guests. I did not, but moving forward, who knows? And now my favorite part, using my serving log and displaying these beautiful, succulent, homemade chicken wings. Mm, mm, mm. No matter who you're rooting for this Super Bowl season, have fun, be smart, be safe, you know, I hope everyone is, is taking the time to be tested and to wear your masks, not trying to be preachy or cozy. I You just know we're in, in trouble in times right now and we all need to be a bit more diligent together and stay safe out there. the garlic parm. It's the garlic parm for me. They were just the winners of this. Um, I'm going to actually make my own lemon pepper seasoning when I do these wings again after I film the video. I, I just, something about that particular brand, it was good, but I feel like we can do better. You know, let's, let's try and do better. <laughs> But thank you all so much for, for rocking with me and for subscribing to my channel. And if you've made it this far, I love you. I wholeheartedly appreciate you. You watching my videos, liking and subscribing thoroughly helps my channel. I'm not monetized yet, but I'm trying to get there. <laughs> well, anyway, I love y'all dearly. Have a wonderful game day. Do enjoy this. Remember, stay safe, be loved. We'll catch you next time.
Here we are again, folks. The finished product. It's game day. Look at these garlic and Parmesan wings. I just can't help myself. It makes me quiver. All right, well, you know me. If you don't know me, you know I always go for the flats. I'm a flat dude. It's been a while since I've done wings on the channel, so here we are. Mm. Yes, love. I'll take all of this, please. I'll see y'all later. <laughs> no, I'm just playing. You want some? You want a bite? Here you go. You can have a bite. Look at that way. Look at that. Thank you all so much for rocking with me. I, I hope that you're enjoying what you're seeing on the channel thus far and you're getting inspired, you're being created, or you're creating some of these dishes or recreating some of these dishes. And if you are, I'd love to see them. Like, tag me on Instagram and show me how you twisted it around and made it your own. You know, put that thing down, flip it, and a burst it. Hey! <laughs> I'm just playing. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and finish my wing. I can't even continue to speak, so I'll see you next week.